Hello and welcome back with Orange PS Man. Today we're for the first time on Summonscape RSPS, our brand new RuneScape private server that is very unique. I've never played such a server before, it's very freaking cool. I'm actually recording the intro and all the first clips after recording the entire video. So this server is brand new, it's a PK based server with a bunch of different modes you guys will be able to choose from. In total we have 30 unique Cures mode and a bunch of tank modes. You guys will have unique pets, everything for that one. Summoners, and you guys will be able to read about all your different account informations right here. You want to click it on it. That is absolute crazy. I'm gonna be choosing and trying out a ton of different game modes right here. For the sake of the introduction, I'm just gonna go with this, I don't know, profound tank. I think I'm gonna be playing this later on anyway. You can go ahead and do the tutorial. You can go ahead and skip it as well. I'm gonna skip it for now. The giveaway is gonna be $100. Still credit to one lucky winner. All you have to do for that one is like the video, comment, your name, down below, and be subscribed to my channel. And of course, make sure you're checking out Summonscape with the links down below because this is actually something crazy. So if I check out my account, this is a preset a bank just for the specific game mode Ryan Hey, Each account you guys will be choosing will have an own unique bank with supplies. As we can see, this is absolute nice, right? I freaking love how we look like. And we also have this golden dragon pad that we're going to be summoning. And this bad boy will be attacking with us. I'm going to be using this game mode later on as well. And uh, yeah, it's going to be absolute freaking. A lot of game modes though do not have pads that you guys will be able to use. Therefore, you guys will have to use summoning. It will tell you what summaries you guys will be using with each uh, account mode. You will have a bunch of different NPCs roaming around the game that you will be able to kill for charms, for supplies and everything. But most of this stuff you'll already have as a preset in the back. And then you guys can literally go ahead and start peeking other people with your different summoners and everything. It is absolute freaking wild. A very important shop is definitely this guy right here. The profound tank shop. So each game mode has different shops as well. So this one is perfectly suitable with the dragon fire shield as well as Barzak Ring Eye that you guys will be able to purchase. We have a bunch of other shops as well that you guys will be able to check out. That is for every single account. But there's also special shops just for the specific game modes. It is absolutely freaking awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and PK now the owner for a showcase of a bunch of different game modes. And I'll be explaining a bit what each game mode is doing. And again, in total, we have 30 plus. Last presets you guys will be able to choose from. It's absolutely freaking funny. Never seen before. I've never done a video in such a side before. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And of course, make sure you join the Discord with the links down below. So first things first, we're gonna show you a couple of locations right here. Goblins, like which are a bit south of the home area, they're gonna be dropping the easiest charms. After you get those, you will have to go and see what uh yeah, avatars, AK summers you can actually go ahead and sport. I've just got myself this bad boy right here with the setup. And by the way, that looks super, super nice. Then you also get these special ones and then you'll go directly into the fight i love the presets the different armor sets we have the different summoners and uh yeah as you can see the summoners are also attacking and they're actually very very powerful we are only combat 40 since these pures are super squishy they're hella freaking fun i have only 26 h bay which is wild same as for him and essentially if you get one good combo out with the specs and everything you can one shot the opponent as we can see we almost killed them that which was absolute nade but unfortunately i did not manage to finish the ko right and high and all these different summers have custom effects as well some are more powerful damage wise others can stun others can heal so it's actually pretty freaking insane and imagine a ton of people like peeking with those bad boys right high and um yeah Again, every game mode has specific summers you can spawn, which is actually pretty freaking cool. This was the first fight against the owner, and bro, I just got fucking demolished. Into the next game mode, I have the Ibans one, which is a pretty powerful one. I really like this one, actually. And that was the mage one. I also had Venge on this game mode right here. A little bit more HP, a bit the tankier one. And I had this major bright. How freaking sexy does my summer look like? Like, this was probably my favorite game mode, honestly, right here. Very powerful as well. I freaking spacked him with Farte. Uh, I had to charge as well my stuff right here. And you can also attack the summoners. I definitely do not recommend to do that. For the showcase, the owner just attacked my summoner as well, as you could say. But overall, I would never recommend to do that. 
His summoner rot here is not as powerful this time. However, he can stun me, so that's actually pretty funny. I don't know if he managed to actually go through with it. And um, yeah, he also had a major account for this one, so that's mage versus mage. There is tank that we used before. Then we have more powerful ones uh, with VLS and everything. But yeah, again, I'll show you all of these later on. So this fight was actually very, very long. And uh, yeah, there we go. I've managed to KO him. That's the first lovely W for ourselves. Then we went to the next game with Ron. Hey, the Zamoroi tank. This sounded very, very interesting. And for this one, we had to go ahead and farm a bunch of charms. Once again, get ready with the setup, which looks very, very sexy once again. This time, I'm going to be using this Tor. The Barca Tor is my summoner. I feel like this one was probably the weakest summoner I had. His was absolute freaking beastful. I mean, look at my freaking Tor versus that freaking talent beast he had. I mean, that looks freaking unfair. I'll be honest with you. But I had a VLS, so this is a very strong uh, setup I had. But I liked him as well because he was very tanky with the Obi more right there. My Toad was attacking pretty decent. Could have KO'd him right there. And then he freaking KO'd me, bro. I mean, what the hell was that? So that's another W for him, unfortunately. Then we went with a Profound Tank. That's actually the game that I've showed you in the intro. Um, a pretty interesting one, I'll be honest with you. With a dragon, the movement of the dragon, as you can see, is a little bit bugged right now. That will be completely fixed. The dragon himself is actually uh, very powerful as well with uh, the different attacks and everything. Boom, Chakalaka. We've got these very quick, actually, uh, mage attacks. Um, I was with melee. I didn't like my setup too much, to be honest. Um, but the cool thing is I had DFS. So DFS into that mage attack, aka Missile of the Dragon, is absolute freaking powerful. But his pet, I think, is one of the best ones, the bulk one. Very, very high DPS. If it lands, it was hitting a lot of zeros, as you can see. But when it lands... It will freaking destroy. As you will see in a second. Absolutely insane. This freaking bulk. My dragon was okay. Didn't hit too high. But hitting pretty consistent. I like that one. And Bri. I just got killed by the bulk with a 200 hit Bri. 93 on HP. That is freaking mental. Into the mummy pure right hey. Another game mode which I used. Um, also looking super freaking nice. Fashionscape is on point. All these items and sets are completely spawned to your bank. On this account, we had a dragon uh, boy, which I thought, yo, fuck it, let's just one-shot him. And it almost worked. Did you see that? I've almost got one-shot as well there. It was so freaking dangerous and crazy. Had a Zara Domin Sport with 30 HP. I mean, these setters are absolute mental. He had a tank again, full Inquisitors, very low um, attack. But his freaking summer was dealing damage like a freaking monk. Obsidian Golem on his side was dealing a lot of damage. I had a really good amount of damage as well. I like this game mode a lot as well. And for some reason, I got one shot. When this freaking mole pissed me off because I wanted to smack him. And um, yeah, that was another F in the chat. Then I went for another game mode, Ryan Hay. We just played around for the showcase of the video. This one with the Crash Spray Ryan Hay. The Arctic Bay, I liked it. I have to say it was a pretty decent uh, DPS, very accurate. However... His freaking uh, thing was very tanky. I was dealing a lot more damage throughout the fight, which was actually very, very exciting. And um, yeah, my 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 summoner was actually pretty fucking decent as well. What I really liked as well is the spack weapon of my crash. I mean, did you see that? That was actually very, very nice. We were hitting very consistent actually. Uh, he was hitting as well fairly consistent. The good thing is he forgot to bring uh, a lot of food with him, which was actually very, very helpful for us. It was a very long fight actually. And this was actually the first death match we had. Also, the spec weapons of these different summoners are very OP. This one right here was doing like this missile, which was also very accurate, actually. And uh, yeah, I really liked my freaking bear run here. And after a very long freaking fight, he was at 1 HP and still tanking it like a freaking beast. I was actually at 1 HP as well. Again, he had half an inventory on your food, so I... This was tragic, bro. This was tragic. And I, oh, I was freaking out. Oh, you guys can see right in here. And I was like, bro, there's no one going to die. And then I freaking killed him. And we both died because the freaking Titan killed me, dude. You guys get there, dude. Ton of fun is waiting for you on Sunscape. Join with the links down below. Don't forget to enter the giveaway by smashing the like button, commenting your names down below, and be subscribed to my channel. Brand new community, brand new project, something truly unique. Thank you so much, Chitini. I love you all. I'll see you all in the game. Have a good one. And peace out, my J.